Guys, I got another job. Oh my God. Okay, ignore the excessive wind coming down my chimney. But it is currently Sunday the 20th of February at 10 o'clock at night. And about an hour ago, I just received a call. Actually, I received an email and then I called back. I am on to my next adventure, which I'm so excited about. I've actually currently got a headache from being so excited about it, actually. Um, but I am going to be on the entertainment team for Welcome Family Park in Devon. I am super excited. It sounds amazing. It looks amazing. I do six days a week of shows and then two to three days a week of like entertainment, like bingo, discos, character skins. So I'm so excited to meet everyone. I'm in a room with one other person. Uh, I'm not in a room. I'm in a um, apartment, a caravan, a place. I'm not too sure um, until we get there. But um, I'm literally, I just need to email him back tomorrow morning. So I'm gonna wait till tomorrow morning, send him a photo, um, say I accept the job which he pretty much knows anyway but i just need to have it in writing then tell him that i'm coming down the other girls go heading down there tomorrow i'm currently on set tomorrow on a new series so i can't go down tomorrow but then the next day i'll pack and i'll probably tell him that i can be down by thursday um just so i can get to know the area and everything like that then yeah this is super exciting, super exciting. I can't quite believe it. So yeah, the vlogs are back. I'm now doing something exciting with my life, which I was before, but not vlog worthy. You know what I mean? So yeah, I'm gonna head off to bed now and I'll probably see you next on Tuesday when I get packing and get sorting my life out for this. <sighs> exciting. That's what you gotta do. You just gotta put yourself out there literally emailed a couple of different parks did park dean butlins haven um and i saw welcome family park was hiring so i was like this looks amazing i looked at their website i looked at their entertainment side and it was top notch so i was like this i can't miss out there so i emailed very quick reply um just had to send over a couple of things had a conversation about half an hour conversation one on one then it was between me and this one other girl then thought I didn't get the job because I've had a really sore throat and they asked for songs and half the songs I couldn't even attempt right now with this throat um so I thought it was just complete not gonna happen then today I got an email and I phoned them back and so exciting super excited i'm so ready to get started i'm so ready to learn more to learn off other people to meet more entertainers to just fucking let's do this so ready i will see you on tuesday probably good morning everyone um it's currently tuesday i'm really out of focus i was meant to go to the gym this morning but oh my god why isn't it it's currently Tuesday. I was meant to go to the gym this morning. My class was at half six. Um, I didn't book in because I didn't know whether I was going to wake up because last night I was on set from two till ten and didn't get back until like half eleven, twelve. Um, so then didn't sleep until like half twelve. But I needed to get up for at like five to get to class. And you know when your alarm goes off? But you don't hear it go off and then you wake up and you realize that you've actually turned your alarm off i was like that's a sign just stay in bed enjoy a lion you haven't had one for a while so enjoy the lion and so that's what i did and it was so worth it and i feel so much more refreshed and then i just kept waking up every 15 minutes because i thought i was gonna be late even though i woke up at like seven quarter past seven quarter to eight then quarter past eight and i was like you know what i'm just gonna get up so um I've had breakfast and I'm going to go and get my hair done. So this was originally meant to be next week, but because I'm going down to Devon this week, I was like, instead of 
it saves me coming back more than once. So I'm actually coming back on the 7th to do my headshots and body shots, which I'm so excited for. I just need to plan and find a gym down in Devon. That's the plan. I'm going to go to the hairdressers. It normally takes about two, three hours. So that's something to look forward to. And then I'm going to come back. Hopefully there's time to go to the gym in between. I'm going to see Sing 2 this afternoon with my friend. So we'll see where the day takes me. And then tomorrow I just need to pack. Like I haven't even started packing. So yeah, I need to sort it out. I got a new, some stuff came in the post today. So I'll show you. So I got, um, if you haven't been on Vinted, get on Vinted because it's so good. I got um, Gymshark matching sports bra and leggings. They're navy, you can't really see the colour really in this light but navy bottoms and top so that'll be one of the outfits for my body shots and then I've got a pile over there for my body shots as well so I'm not going to take that down to Devon just so when I come down when I come back up it's all set out and I don't have to stress about finding and rummaging through what I'm actually going to take so yeah, that's the plan. I'm not sure whether I'm going down Thursday or Friday now. Um, I might go down Friday, just so I've had a bit more time and I can get back to the gym again. Um, I say back to the gym, I've only had one day off, but you know what I mean. Eric. I see you. So it's a lot later in the day, just ignore all the mess out the back. Um, yeah. Uh, it is currently 5.23, Lucy's about to pick me up. We're about to go to the cinema and then heading off to the pub after. So I've just got some sheen straight leg jeans, I think they're called. I think this is sheen, maybe I saw it first. And then sheen cardigan. Um, then I'll just throw my coat over the top. I find these kind of trousers really hard to pair with like a jumper or something. Um, so I need to get like a nice jacket that I can pair. But this will do. This will do. White is um, an interesting colour to go for. But we're there. So this is my new fresh hair. I got it cut today. Absolutely love it. Um, don't know why I'm vlogging in the mirror. But that happened. So I'm heading off. And I'll see you tomorrow where I'm actually going to get shit done and pack and sort my life out um because today just that was not just gonna happen okay so it is wednesday um wednesday the 23rd so two more days till i leave i don't know if i said thursday but i'm leaving friday now so um just to give me a bit of extra time to sort myself out so i'm not packing packing today but i've just put them into piles so i'll show you my piles that sounds odd um so i've got dance shoes socks sort of suck-ins and that kind of vibe swimming costume because i'm in devon some dressy stuff which i still need to put together i just need to ask mum her opinion on which ones i should take um trousers and jeans sports bra leggings still need to find all my leggings because they're on the wash uh t-shirts and long sleeve tops under layers because apparently it's quite cold smaller tops pajamas pajama and joggers pants and then over here, I've got my, I don't know if I've told you, but I've got on the 7th, I'm coming back to do my body shots and headshots. So I'm not taking any of that stuff until I've done my headshots and body shots, just so it's all together and that's sorted. Um, I've then got my Dr. Nelson. Um, if you're a singer, I definitely recommend. I've got this. It looks like a pipey thing. Um, but... I'm going to take that, I need to take toothbrush chargers, that can all be done at the end though. Um, I think I'm going to take a dressing gown and I don't think I'm going to take any like summery stuff yet because it's just not worth it at the moment and I mean if anything worse comes to worse I can bring it back on the 7th after my photo shoot. But yeah so I think that's all I'm going to do for now If and then just sort of add to it as I go along. I would happily pack all my wardrobe, but I think that's a little bit excessive, so, and I tend to overpack, so I'm trying my best not to overpack, 
but if I forget anything, I'm gonna be so annoyed. I went to go and watch Sing last night, Sing 2, and oh my god. I don't think anyone will realise, unless they're like in love with their performing arts and what they do. I know they're cartoons and it sounds really stupid, but when there was performing, when there was a standing ovation, I was like, <laughs> really sobbing. I was like, this is beautiful, even though they're cartoons, so don't judge me, but. I, whenever there's a performance or standing ovation, Apparently, even if it's cartoon, it just gets me really emotional because I know how it feels and I can't wait to get that feeling back again. Um, I haven't performed on stage for a while. So yeah, I got my first script through for um, one of our shows, which I'm really excited for. It's got lots of dialogue, lots of songs in there. I can't wait, I can't wait. I am super excited, super excited. And I hope I can keep vlogging while I'm there, but we'll see, we'll see. Because you're performing as well, you need all this extra stuff. It's not just a, I'm moving for work. It's I'm moving for work. And my work has also got its own kind of wardrobe. But it'll be done. It'll get done. It has to get done. But it'll get done. And luckily I can drive, so I can just throw everything in the car if it doesn't fit into my suitcase. But mum's suggesting me take the white suitcase, which is a lot smaller than the suitcase I took to Finland, if you've seen that video. But yeah, we'll see. I'll see you in the next clip. Good morning, everyone. It is the next day, so I leave tomorrow. Um, I've got my suitcase. This is one of the smaller ones. But mum recommend, reckons it's going to be big enough. I think this is her way of saying, don't overpack, use this. If it doesn't fit, don't take it. But yeah, I'm going to try and load if it's too small. I'll just go and get the bigger one. Um, so I'm just putting tablets, wash stuff, toilet, basically some toiletries, um, these, if you're a singer, best things ever, the right way around, they're so good, and also I'll show you this, um, they're like, um, throat sweets, they're best cure ever, um, there's also this same kind of brand they do it looks like nanny mcphee's medicine so it's not it doesn't look very nice but it's actually quite nice and it does wonders for your throat <laughs> this is so far what i've got i put some like dance tights out just in case um, got all my dance heels and shoes in there along with like books and stuff. Script I've got, stuff that a little bit more classy and dressy but still need to add to that with mum. And then got my laptop bag and that and a bag. So I think I'm pretty much there. I'm just sitting here and suddenly, I don't know if you can see, you can't see unless I like show you where I live. Um, but it's absolutely hailing outside. It looks like the way it's landed on everything. Whoa. <laughs> the way it's landed on everything, it looks like snow. It's a lot. Sorry, my hair has gone so frizzy. I must have like, in the night, touched it a lot. Yeah, so I'm just about to. I've just got all the bedding. I've got two lots of beddings, um, four pillow covers, bed sheets, and duvet cover thing so yeah i'm gonna do gonna change these covers now but not the sheet so i can take both of them with me and then i'll just have to load everything into the car in the morning and then after that i'm gonna head off to wash my car so it can finally get washed because no one can seem to wash it which is really annoying but we'll see we'll see it's literally so filthy. So many people have tried to wipe this, but no one's been able to clean it. So this is the plan. It's got like swipes on it. 
Okay, I'm heading off to go and pick my friend up, Lucy. Um, we're gonna go and clean my car because it needs it. And why not do it today? My battery's flashing, so I won't record. And I'll see you when I get back. Hopefully, they actually clean it because no one's been able to clean my car. It was white and now it's just not. So, let's see if I can do an after shot of it being really nice and clean. Now, they have cleaned it quite well, but for all of this still, I don't know if you can see it in the camera, but it just doesn't come off. And that's the problem with my car. It's got so much stuff on it. Very annoying. As much as it's a shame that the car's not like fully clean, it's a lot cleaner than it was before. So at least that's done. And it's pretty much clean. Um, it, well, it's a, it's a lot cleaner than it was before, I can tell you that. So at least we got that. So that's done. I've pretty much done everything. Everything. Just need to put my wash stuff all together. And then I'm done. So I'm going to chill out, charge this battery. And then we're going to order a curry for dinner later on. I have just had a shower, as you can see from my hair. Um, at least it's looking a bit more healthy than it was today earlier. I have finished packing, pretty much, I think. Spot Eric. He's so unhelpful. Um, Eric. Eric. Come off. Come on. Eric, at least get off this. I don't want you standing on that. It's gonna bend. Um, of course you get off. Got pretty much all my clothes in there. Have packed all towels and bedding. Off products. Dirty washing that I can wash there. Don't. All my makeup products under there. All hair products and extra stuff. My tripod. I've got my Dr. Nelson perfume. Which both of those I need to wrap up so they don't break. Eric's now in the bin. Nightmare. Roller, all dance shoes and books and stuff, and then all cables. So I think that's pretty light for me. I'm pretty impressed with that. Um, however, you okay in there? Yeah. What is he doing? Shall I pick it up for you? anyway as i was saying yeah it's pretty much all packed um that's pretty light for me i'm pretty impressed i've just got two food bags downstairs and then yeah i think i'm done and we'll see in the morning i'm gonna go out for a coffee well i'm getting a hot chocolate but in the morning with mum and then go from there Pretty sure I got everything. <laughs> My God. This cat needs a camera hit on him all times. Like he's actually nuts. Like he thinks he's a dog, I swear. He's such a weirdo, but gotta love him. Anyway, I'm going to finish this now. And I'll see you in the morning when I'm travelling. Welcome family park. I'm so excited. So excited. It's going to be good. It's going to be good. Good morning. Today is the day. I'm so excited. I didn't really sleep very well because I kept waking up thinking I was late. Even though there's nothing to be late for. Because I can just get there anytime. But very annoying. Yeah, so the plan today. Well, the plan this morning is to pack all of this pack all of that into the car then I'm gonna head off for a hot chocolate with mum and then I'm gonna come back and head off so I'll see you after my hot chocolate in the car right I've all packed everything's packed I'm just getting the postcode and I'm heading off super excited um, it's meant to take three hours 40 however I run over lunch so I might stop for some lunch yeah and I'll let you know when I'm there See you in a bit. I've just arrived um, 
and someone's going to come and collect me and take me to where I'm staying. It's beautiful. It's a good thing it's a really sunny nice day as well. All unpacked. I am all settled in and um, I've got the hiccups for some reason. Had dinner, had a shower, went to the shops for a bit to get some snacky bits because we're going over to Jack's to have a little movie night and snacky bit. I've met four people so far, three people on the show team and one security guard. So yeah. I'm going to end it here so thank you very much for watching like subscribe comment and share this with your friends and make sure you hit that bell icon so you know when i next upload hopefully i can get rid of this hiccups so annoying